Hi, Love Collective. Um, I hope everybody's doing all right. Um, jeez, y'all. Um, all right, yesterday I did a reading, and it said we're going to have unexpected visitors, right? 3 o'clock this morning, 3.40 this morning, I get a knock on the door, and it's um, somebody that you knew... Their new girl it, it's kind of a karmic. Um, I'm not sure the I'm not sure what's going on with this girl is knocking on the door. I don't even know her name. She knows my name because I'm a star. Okay, <laughs> I guess this hotel and everybody in this town knows my name because I've talked about. Okay, but I don't know her name, but I've met her before. She was so drunk. She was drunk so bad, um, and I I yelled at her because she was banging on the door and wouldn't stop. And I I stay somewhere else. It ain't my home. Okay, and um, she, she's knocking on my door. Do, 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 do. I'm in the living room, right? I, sleeping on my little bed and I'm, I'm like go away man I'm asleep I don't know who's calling my name out there but leave okay well she wouldn't she kept knocking 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 so I opened the door and I said man I gotta work tomorrow this ain't even my house I don't know who you are coming up in here knocking on the door like this well I kind of ran her off as soon as I ran her off I felt guilty man I went back in the house five seconds later I walk out of the house to go see if I can see her and they're just gone just disappeared here comes a cop with spotlights, shining spotlights, looking everywhere, um, going back down behind the building beside us and all this. And I stopped and I said, hey, man, there was a drunk girl just come knocked on my door. Um, and I don't know where they went, okay? Um, um, I'm kind of worried now. He said, yeah, that's who I'm looking for. Um, um, they was worried about her because she was so drunk and somebody was helping her. And they was worried that something might happen to her. Well, somehow or another, this drunk girl, she couldn't even stand. I don't know how she got where she was at so fast, okay? But I feel like that I should have talked to her, but I was in a sleep state and, like, angry that somebody was knocking on the door, and I kind of ran her off. But I feel like that she came over there to tell me something because um, she kept acting like she was going to tell me something. She just kept saying my name, but she was so drunk. Um... She was just had a jimpy, jimpy, <laughs> and she was stumbling around. I was like, y'all need to go, man. I kept kind of like, like coaxing her away by her elbow, and and then I went back in. As soon as I, as soon as I went back in, I laid down two seconds, jumped up, and went back out the door. They were gone. Okay, um, boy claims that she made it to her house and that and that and that. Um, I, I gotta believe him, but I mean, I ain't heard nothing from the police, but, um. I feel like that she was coming to tell me something, and that was totally freaking unexpected. I'll tell you what. So unexpected is that I ran her off and didn't give her a chance to really um, say what she was going to say because she had to have specifically been walking up there to where I stay at because nobody really knows that I stay there, and the people that know that I stay there, um, you know, they're not going to knock on the door at 4 o'clock in the morning because that's my boss's house. Okay, anyway, so I thought I'd tell y'all that the unexpected visitor did come. <coughs> <coughs> Somebody's um, going to rock you. Okay, let's see what Zoltar has to say this morning. Hear your fortune from Zoltar. Men of genius are admired. Men of wealth are envied. Men of power are feared. But only men of character are trusted. Only men of character are trusted, okay? Um, so keep that in mind, okay? Now, I would have took the girl home if she would have just said, can you take me home? Um, but it felt like she was trying to tell me something, like she was trying to tell me something, but she was so drunk, she couldn't get it out, okay? Um, and, and I'd like for her to come back by and talk to me if she wants to talk to me, okay? Because I feel, I, as soon as I ran her off, I felt bad. Um, I knew that it was because I was woke up, um, because I'm no good when I, when I get woke up, um, I have to wake up myself, um, but if I get woke up, I don't care what time it is, if I get woke up, I'm, I'm, I'm mean, okay, and I know this about myself, okay, <laughs> you know, so I'm not, I'm not, I know that I'm, I'm ill when I get woke up because I don't sleep very much, like I just, hard, I just, all my life had a hard time sleeping my whole life. Okay, your fortune is 
Now is the time to start that new project you've been contemplating. Um, your deliberation will pay off in the long run because doubt is the father of invention and the key to knowledge. Um, this newfound industry pays debts, while if you're in despair, you will only increase them. The time is right to get going. If you are to move the world, first you must move yourself. If you find yourself working too hard to achieve your goals, you may find basic truth. Um, the great person with vigor would demand the rightness of things, timeliness of actions, and priority of method. In this way, power does not become sheer force. You will be surprised at what you will accomplish. Okay, um, so you got to start um, making the moves. If you want to change the world, you got to move to change the world. Okay. Um, I think they're just changing places, y'all. Okay. You have to move. You have to make movement in order to move. You understand? You cannot just sit and be still um, um, if, you're, if you're trying to make change things in your, in your life. Okay. You have to do work. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm paying attention to these customers. See if they're going to come in here. They're probably not. They're probably just traveling to change places. Okay, thank you, Archangel Michael, for coming down, guarding and protecting us because we channel the messages. Thank you, ancestors, and sending messages for all the helpful healing messages that you give, the truth. Um, thank you for the healing. Thank you, uh, Collective, for, for all your comments and your support. Um, thank you, Holy Spirit, for always being there to guide me. And thank you, Jesus Christ, for all your sacrifices that you gave to me. Okay, um, Jesus Christ is my BFF, y'all. Look, it says Shamanic Heal Healer. Um, I don't know what this reading is going to be about right now. Um, I'm just, uh, we're going to pull a couple cards and find out what they want to tell us. That's that's like ten, y'all. I can't. You're going to have to do it one at a time. Thank you, Spirit. Past life guides and shamanic healer. That's what I've seen. Okay. Um, what do we need to know? Give me one card. What is What is the most important thing to talk about today? One card. Two cards. Shamanic healer, y'all. Prophets and ancient seers. Y'all can't make it up, okay? The healing heart is on the bottom, okay? Um, 17 and 18, okay? Um, it says cleansing and attunement, okay? Um, you're getting in touch with your, 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 your eagle, your, your spirits. Um, they're, they're coming to you. They're, they're, they're surrounding you. They're giving you uh, guidance, Okay? Prophets and ancient seers, decisions and predictive guidance. Okay, um, you already know something is going on. Um, you're just waiting on the signs. Okay, um, man, these cards are beautiful though. Let me let me hold them up and let y'all look at these. This is something about the heart, um, opening your heart to see. Okay, and this is something about you need to ground yourself so you can get into your higher consciousness. Okay, so you don't get floaty or flighty or whatever. Um, you need to get grounded um, to open up your heart. You see something in your heart. You see it already. Okay, there's something going on in your heart that you see already. Okay, let me see if y'all can see these. Okay, you can. Okay. Alright, so let's find out what we want to... What's collective need to know? What's collective need to know about this? Um, you're a healer, y'all. Without a doubt, you're a healer. Okay? Um, you're also a seer. You can see. Uh, you're getting guided through through some type of um, higher consciousness. Look, you're also royalty. You see this um, out this cloak that she's wearing. She's some type of royalty. And listen to this, y'all. You know, I do research all the time. I just don't talk about it all the time. But um, look, the truth. Okay. Anyway. Um, I was doing some research yesterday, and they were talking about the wife of God is called, um, Ikesha, Ikesha, something to that effect, okay, um, but what they were saying, God dang, man, everything, everything they were saying was like so resonant, it was so crazy, but she tried to defend, um, because she loves all her children equally, and all the angels, she was there in the beginning with chaos and um, darkness and um, God, okay? Um, she can somehow, um, 
she tames chaos. Okay. Um, they man, they can use manipulate chaos into working in the favor of God. Okay. Um, somehow. Y'all look it up though. It's the wife of God. It's called the wife of God. Um, it's probably in my playlist somewhere. Um, I think it's under this and must watch heal. Okay. Sometimes I put them too. Queen of Pentacles. You know something is coming. You're having an awakening about money coming. Okay. Um, you're having some kind of prophetic uh, awakening. Okay. And you know that some kind of money or some kind of stability is coming. Okay. Um, somebody's been watching you. Somebody's been watching you struggle. And somebody's been watching somebody else watch you struggle. And they are holding the truth. Okay. Um, the sun is about to shine and messages are coming. It looks like three of them. It looks like three messages are coming in about this um, Queen of Pentacles. Okay. And what else we need to know? What else collective need to know? Queen of Wands, you're manifesting something. You're manifesting this truth and this money. Okay? Um, it's coming in. You're royalty. Open up your heart. Look, you're wearing purple and green right here. Um, she even looks pregnant. Okay? Like you're you're like you're pregnating a new a new idea um, to gain money. Damn. She almost looks pregnant too, the Queen of Wands does, but somebody is um, manifesting this um, this truth and this money to come in, okay? Um, Y'all, another freaking queen, okay? Queen of Cups is here to clarify the Queen of Pentacles, okay? Wow, she's in all gold, okay? There's electric going on, um, electricity going on. Look, this is... She really looks pregnant. You see her hand on her on her tummy? Okay, these people look pregnant for some reason to me today. Oh my God, the King of Wands. He's the one gonna come in and tell the truth. He's been watching. He's been watching this. This struggle. He's looking at the Queen of Cups. Y'all, he's looking directly at her and she's looking directly at him. I guess he's looking directly at her. He kind of looks like he's trying to look around her. There's nothing behind her. But she's looking right directly at him. Okay, clarify the Queen of Wands. What else? Something you didn't see. Something you didn't see. Divine is bringing you a cup of something you didn't see to bring you stability. Three messages here, too. You're manifesting something to come out that you didn't see, but it's been watching you. Okay? Whatever it is has been watching you. So it's being put to a death. Something's being put to a death for a new start. Burdens. Burdens are being put to a death. Being released. There's two, two deer here. Okay, what else? What else? Someone's packing up. Someone's about to move. Someone's packing up these burdens um, to, to get to release them for balance. Someone's about to move to their prosperity, to their to their balance and their money. Thought I seen one come out. Looks like it could be a Libra. You got some kind of helping hands as well, or somebody trying to dip their hands in your money. Okay? But these hands are just out of nowhere. But they're not holding your money. This balance is coming, okay? Um, this card right here depicts like a beggar and, um, uh, well, two beggars actually and someone um, giving them out money, but they're only giving out to one beggar, okay? It says the chariot. This is all for the uh, moving in quickly. Um, this chariot is, look, there's tw three queens out here. She's moving in to be, she's moving up to be the, um, the, the, the empress, okay? But this king of wands feels like he needs to hurry up. He feels like he needs to hurry up and do something. Make it public. Okay, we got six of wands, six of pentacles. Oh, these went to the floor. What? We got the hanged man. Someone was left dangling. This is going to be publicly known. Temperance. 
to be balanced out and it's in full motion it can't be stopped it's in full motion this is destiny okay um, this is in full motion from divine okay the queen of swords all four queens are out here okay she's just waiting on the truth y'all the same this queen of pentacles waiting on the truth um, manifesting it to come to come to her this queen this king of wands is watching this queen of cups she's watching him um, looks like that he's like wanting to get things balanced out okay and she's watching him um, looks like somebody's going to leave, though. Like, somebody's trying to move. Okay? What do we need to know about the Queen of Swords? She's just waiting on the truth, but this, this truth is in action. This truth is in motion, y'all. Yeah, look at here. Eight of Swords. Okay? Um, this is some kind of destiny coming. It's got you chained up and tied down, waiting on this dang truth. Um, to come in, you're about to walk away. I'm telling you, you're about to walk away because you're tired of this. Um, uh, not not going anywhere, okay? Um, it's been in your head a little bit about it and blinded to a lot of shit because of um, you're not seeing other things that are going on because of this, okay? Um, yeah, you block. You're gonna block it. it. Looks like you're blocking it, okay? Um, secret is that they're gonna come in anyway. <laughs> what it looks like okay um clarify the eight of swords and two of swords the empress she's she's gonna walk away i'm telling you it's showing that this empress is leaving she's walking away okay she fell on temperance and the hangman okay eight and she's gonna get the ace of pentacles when she does okay um i don't know where to tell you to go but yeah your, your wish fulfillment and money Okay, I can't make it up. Hey, what else we need to know? What else we need to know? It says you're going out into the world. It's got a turtle on here. The sun. This empress has seen the sun. Um, she's about to be publicly recognized. Okay? Because um, she was left dangling. And somebody has done something. Listen, y'all. Y'all, I don't know. Look, judgment. Judgment on what? Judgment on what? The king of pentacles. Judgment on the King of Pentacles. What's the judgment? The Knight of Swords. Going to come in and tell the truth. Huh. What else? What else about this King of Pentacles? Tower. This truth is going to cause a tower. Okay. But that's good. A good thing. Because he's holding on. This, ki this King of Pentacles is holding on to this lover situation, y'all. Yep, he's holding on. He's not letting go. Um, even though you think that he might have let go, he had not let go. Look, his heart is broken. He's, he's uh, letting go of the third party. Okay. It says he's been struggling. Okay, but he's invested in this, and he's ready to come forward and, st and come to the edge and tell the truth about it. Okay, um, it's a little bit, he's a little bit shy about it, I'm a little immature about it, but he's going to. It's a past life connection. Um, uh, you've gained wisdom and everything else through all of this, um, so be grateful, okay? I know that he might have done the most to you, but you've gained so much. Um, going through this, um, you've learned so much, and you, um, your, your, your um, natural instincts are stronger. Your natural powers are stronger. Um, you're more confident in your abilities and yourself and the divine. Um, so be grateful. I'm thankful for it. Look, he's coming in. He's gonna tell the truth. Went from the nine of swords to the king of swords. Um, page of swords, nine of swords to king of swords. He's gonna come in and tell the truth. He's looking straight down here at this empress. Look. He's looking down here at her. These cards are, are looking at each other, okay? Bottom of the deck is the Knight of Cups. He wants to bring you a cup of love. Um, he's saying that you're the one. He's exposing all this. He's saying that you're the one. You're the one that shines the brightest. You're the, you're the best one, okay? Um, try, somebody's trying to um, expose something else, okay? 
basically you as the star. It says that he's struggling like hell about it because he puts you to the back. He put he turned his back on you. Okay? He turned his back. Now he's struggling and going through chaos and shit over these three, okay? And there's three messages again, y'all. There's messages coming in about this. It's the emperor. That is so crazy. He's looking at her. She, the emperor, empress is just like chilling and doing her thing. Uh, she's not, she's not worried about it. And, and the emperor is, is now coming in and watching the empress, okay? Moving it on to calmer waters um, for justice, okay? Anything else? Anything else? Look, the king of swords is looking at justice too. Okay. It says the secret is being exposed. The moon card. The secret is being exposed. It's something to do with a cancer, y'all. I'm telling y'all. It's something to do with a cancer. Um, the first thing I seen was the crab. Yeah, someone's releasing past um, past lives, looking into the world, um, wanting to start a new. Three messages. Two of cups. Y'all, you're about to get this two of cups with somebody that you feel the same way about. They feel you, okay? You feel you feel the same towards them. Okay, and you just kind of been waiting on truth to come in. Okay, balance. Balance and love. Got a big old ass kitty cat face and a, a, a rabbit. There's growth. Looks like this is divine too. That looks like a cross to me. Somebody's um, uh, carrying truth. Okay. Um, going through a gate with the truth. Okay, somebody's walking through a gate with the truth to the star. Okay, um, you are the star. You are the balance. You are the equal between the land and the water. Um, your 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 third eye is wide open. Okay, um, you know what the hell's going on. You're vulnerable. Um, you're sitting there naked. Okay, you don't have nothing to hide. Nothing at all to hide. You are the star. You shine the brightest, and you don't have nothing to hide. You're manifesting this. You're manifesting a brand new start. Somebody is. Somebody's manifesting um, justice. Rising above. Manifesting justice. Because it landed on justice. Okay. Lord, that card, the world. All of it's gonna be exposed. You're gonna you're gonna rise up and be well known. Um, this woman's got stars all over her clothes. Okay, you're gonna be known all over the world. Okay. Um but you're not gonna be known. Look, you're wearing a mask in this picture, okay? Um, there's a mask. Um, okay, say for instance, okay, we're going to say it like this. My name is Jean Bean, okay? But my, I go by Angel Moon on my YouTube channel um, because um, I, I couldn't get Jean Bean. It's a long story. Anyway, Angel Moon has been with me for, for, for a long, 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 long time, like many, 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 many years, so I decided to go with Angel Moon as the name of my oracle, okay? Um, and um, you're going to be known, well known, but as that other name. Like, people are going to know me as Angel Moon, even though y'all all, all my collective knows that, my, that I'm Jean Bean, okay? Um, they, you're going to be known as something else, like a, like a different name. You see the mask? Okay, but she's a star, okay? Um, so you... They're going to know your name, who you are, but they're going to know you as, okay, um, as, like, Angel Moon, okay? Um, but you're going to be well-known either way, okay? It's still going to go in your cha-ching, okay? <laughs> Ain't going in somebody else's, all right? It says um, somebody's going to be walking away from all, the, all the, the, the lies and the mountains. They're looking out to the world going, okay, I've climbed all these mountains, all this other bullshit is nothing but a bunch of fake ass shit. Um, I'm done with that. Okay? And you're turning your back on it. Okay? It could be this Capricorn. The devil is turning their back on all of that for his destiny. He's coming in for this Empress. This devil is coming in for this Empress. It's the King of Swords. And the King of Wands. The King of Pentacles. Says, yeah, the high priestess knows. Look, the devil and the high priestess over here by this empress. Um, that she was being juggled. Okay. She knows that he was seeing her as the rainbow over the other one too. And um, and felt, 
fell short, something happened. Okay, yeah. This this high priestess knows that the devil juggled her. Okay, and he's wanting to come in and bring love. Okay, or you offered him a cup of love and he turned it down. Okay, no, he's coming in with action. Look, two pages facing one another. I want y'all to look. Somebody's taking action towards this love. Okay, they're going towards one another. And someone's got a lot of life in them um, about this situation. Okay. But yeah, that's a couple. A page of cups and a page of wands. That page of wands has got stars all over her. Okay, I'm telling y'all, this is your, your star. Okay, wish fulfillment and love because the hair font, the judgment has been made. Okay, you're going to get your wish fulfillment and love. Somebody likes to um, crochet or something to that effect or, or knit. Um, maybe it's trying to tell you to sow your seeds because they're coming. Okay, um, this betrayal right here. Um, the hair font is, 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 this hair font is making this betrayal, um, balanced, okay, um, nine cups to the ten swords, um, that one cup that's missing truly loves you, but they betrayed you as well, okay, um, yeah, you got betrayed in love, um, and the hair font's gonna fix it, look, gonna make it all beautiful, you see, all of these are beautiful, Okay, there's growth, love dove, water and fire to purify the stars, a rainbow, and higher consciousness. Okay, um, through your experiences that you've dealt with, um, and it's nine of cups, um, you've, you've had partners and you got to the point where uh, you know this is life experience. Okay, you see them wearing the, the green shirt. Okay, um, this is just life experience, those, those things that you've went through, um, through your whole past, all your past, um life on this 3D world right now, um, those were experiences to lead you up to knowing, to this Ten of Cups, to know exactly what you want. Uh, and I want y'all to write it down. I want you to write on a piece of paper what you want in a mate. Be very, very specific, okay? What do you want in a mate? What do you want? What do you want out of a mate, okay? And write it all down. Write every single thing down, even if it sounds outrageous um, and it just just couldn't be. Um, write it down. Y'all, I can't make this shit up. Ace of Cups and Ace of Wands come out together. They popped out and fell together. Okay. You're about to get this. This action is being taken by this Capricorn. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's the Capricorn. It's the devil. Um... That's what they represent, but they also represent someone who's real skilled and obsessed with this situation. Someone may have gotten obsessed with it, mirroring you, wanting to bring you this cup so bad they can taste it, okay? Um, they're in hermit mode, seeing the light, standing on, standing on that road less traveled. You see this? Shining the light on something, okay? Um, what is the hermit shining the light on? The Knight of Wands taking action. This person is, like, flying in, like, rushing in, okay? He shined the light on the Knight of Wands. Show me what, what we need to know. The truth. Because the truth is coming to the fair lady. Okay, bottom of the deck, a brand new start, y'all. Um, the Knight of Pentacles, fantasy, um, everything you dreamed of, okay? Destiny. Um, you may have Leo in your in your rising chart, or they may have um, uh, Leo in theirs, but this is some kind of strength and destiny. Um, she's got stars all over her, y'all. Y'all can't make that up. You're a star, okay? Some kind of stability and celebrations, okay? Um, somebody's going to bring you a gift of money, okay, um, from your past life. Somebody from the past is going to bring you a gift of money. Did you loan somebody money and they didn't pay you back? You're going to get your money back, okay, because um, this, this truth is coming from this past life. Um, somebody's been feeling guilty for stealing from you for a while now. The King of Cups. <laughs> They're in love with you. This love is being protected, too. Saturn is a protection planet, okay, and this love is being protected. He's even been praying. You see the cross across him? 
This man's been praying and everything. Please, God, please. Oh, please, God, please. Let let them accept me. Let them accept me. Da 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 da. I can hear him saying it. Please, God, please. Now, you're about to hear a message from it. Um, your destiny. Um, there's gonna be a little message, and luck is gonna come in. Okay. <clears throat> this says two messages. Okay, but I believe you're gonna have three, because the other ones are showing three messages. Um, communication is gonna open up. Look, there's five messages coming in about that. Okay. Well, fortune is the end of the deck, y'all. That tops it off. It started off with the Queen of Pentacles. The Wheel of Fortune is going to turn in your favor. Okay? I'm just saying. You're getting the wheel, baby. So just be happy. Be joyful. I know lots of crazy shit going on in your life right now. Lots of crazy shit happening. But you know what? Usually when the crazy shit's going on is usually when... The, the after that when the crazy shit get starts settling down that's when your rewards and your in your um, your uh, abundance and things come okay because you're not thinking about them because your mind is all all crazy about um, the shit that's happened you understand <laughs> okay because um, you're you're being distracted to see all this other crap when truly um, it's to distract they're trying to the darkness is trying to make you where you don't see the, the blessing or the abundance okay um but um you're gonna see this one because divine's gonna make sure of it that you're gonna get this one you understand um divine's making sure of that okay, i'm sorry i gotta make me come coffee i hadn't drank coffee in two weeks and i feel like drinking it today okay i've been doing really good about not drinking coffee because you know i try not to um, cause I, I didn't drink coffee or smoke cigarettes or nothing for five years. Started back because of a, a love, a very karmic, karmic, karmic love situation. Um, there was blowing smoking shit in my face. And I started smoking again. Anyway, um, so I'm gonna put, I'm just gonna sit these cards in here cause I don't want to put them in that day again. Okay. Um, what else do we need to know right now? This, uh, these. It says you use any energy oracles. Now know that you, y'all. I need you to really, 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 really listen to me. Okay. I can't make it up. Over and over and over and over and over and over again, you've been told that you are a healer, a shaman, a teacher. Okay. You need to study to show thyself to be true, even though you have natural abilities. You're psychic, okay? Um, but it's um, the it's not. Um, let me say how I'm trying to say it. You can't just turn it on and turn it off like a light switch, okay? It just happens, okay? It just happens. Someone asks you a question, you start feeling these feelings, and you're able to tell them something that you don't even know nothing about, okay? Well, you need to start um, kind of like um, practicing meditation opening your third eye um i can tell you some techniques to how to open your third eye okay um but um uh, look man holding the coin is coming in second ago is the woman holding the coin no sex is in the spiritual world uh, that's all i'm saying okay um so yeah take what resonates all right anyway i can't even believe that timer stopped already um because i'm not done Okay, so we're going to start it again, so we might go into an hour. Okay, anyway, so, um, God, Amadi, I just had like a download or something. Listen, y'all remember a while back I did a reading about, um, somebody, look, thinking, man. About somebody acting like they're you and marrying somebody. Okay, I, y'all tell me how do it, how do you find out? Um, if you if 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 you're married and you don't know it, how do you find out? Y'all tell me in the comments. Man holding the heart, y'all. This man is coming in, no doubt about it, y'all. The man holding the coin, the thinking man, and the man holding the heart, y'all. I cannot make this shit up. Y'all see that, right? Wow, he's sally Batman. He says that's the truth. He's coming in to tell the truth. Okay, I'm just gonna put that to the side. Um, door spirit. 
Says, yep, use your gut on this. This is a 43, 46, 45, and then the truth is a 39. Then we got a 36. Okay. The sun. This thinking man has seen the sun. He's using his gut. Okay. This is the same guy. Okay. And Archangel Michael here to protect it. That's crazy. He's telling you to get grounded. Because this person is coming in. This is somebody that you know already. This person has somehow got money. Whether it been stole from you or what. But anyway, it's not talking about that right now. It's talking about this man is coming in. Holding his heart to tell you the truth. Um, and he's using his instinct. Um, he wasn't before. Archangel Michael is guiding him. Victory. He's going to have victory. Okay. Victory's coming out in, in this reading. Um, it's for you. So you're going to have victory too. There's some kind of deceit. Some kind of deceit out of the victory. Okay. Let's see what this deceit card is out of this victory. The contract. The contract was... was Somebody was blind and in their head about it and deceived you. You got strength coming. Okay, somebody was... Look, hostilities. Look, oh, that's too many. Hostilities. They were just deceit. 25 and 26. Waiting at the... You've been waiting and waiting on this truth and you're about to walk through that door. Um, somebody's transformed. Okay, you're, you're about to go to your temple path. You're the woman holding the heart. You were deceived. Somebody deceived you in this contract, and it either you're hostile or pissed off about it, and you're waiting on the truth to come, um, or they're pissed off and, and wanting to come and tell you the truth. But it's the person that's in love with you um, gonna, that deceived you and going to come in and tell you the truth. Cornucopia. Got a 44 and 11 on your instinct. Door to personal healing and happiness. The sun. Okay. Door to romance. Y'all can't make these cards come out like this. Y'all see what the hell's going on. Okay. Bottom of the deck is to show appreciation to the angels. Um, that's who they want you to um, count your blessings. Um, and be appreciative of what you do got so they can give you more. Because they want you to have more. And they just want you to be appreciative of it. Be patient. Um, quit getting upset. This is moving in progression. 15 and 16. Um, you're about to move on from this heartbreak. Okay. And this financial constraints. Okay. You're, you're moving on from that. From that. Walking away from the heartbreak and financial constraints to this caring connection. Okay. Um, you are the goddess of the moon. Okay. Um, something had you tied up. The financial constraints had you tied up. Use your gut on this man holding the coin okay use your gut instinct use joy create joy okay create joy if you can't if you if you don't have joy create that shit somebody is envious as hell about this man loving you okay somebody knows something that you haven't been told you know but you haven't been told somebody's jealous that this is this is a yin and yang connection Okay, that could have been an unexpected guest last night. You're about to go on a journey on this um, 2 2 2. Y'all, it's a 20, a 22, and a 2. Four twos, coupling, partnership, together, union, all of it. Caring connection. Okay, I can't make it up. Y'all seen that, didn't you? Ma magic, look, the magician in the mirror. Um, you're mirroring. They're mirroring you, okay? Um, you're you're mirroring them, and they're mirroring you. Do you understand me? Um, those aspects about yourself that you don't normally act like are coming out, and those aspects about themselves don't normally act like are coming out. You're mirroring each other. Um, last night when I got aggressive, I told her leave, and she kept saying my name over and over, and I said leave. And I wasn't gonna hit her or nothing, you know. I was just trying to make her leave because I was I had to work this morning. And I kept taking her by the elbow, pushing her by the elbow like that. And she goes, Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. And she was like stoning around. I was like, I don't even know you because I didn't recognize her. It was dark outside, you know. 
and um and she and the, and the dude was with her she said she don't know you and she said Jean Bean but you know me I'm Jean you're Jean Bean she kept saying that and I said yeah I'm Jean Bean but I don't know who you are and so then they started walking off <laughs> and um I feel like that something was told to her um in some type of drunken stupor or something okay um you're you're stepping off into the world um you're manifesting a new and mirroring it with your counterpart okay angel love anything else on these metatron metatron is opening that higher consciousness that's what i told you in that um that seven of uh cups metatron's here to open up your higher consciousness so you can open up your heart release something from the past because you're getting love and money just like right here you're walking away from heartbreak and financial constraints headed to a caring connection because you know instinctively that there's something else going on um, um, about this man holding the coins okay um, and the, 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 he's in love with you okay but you know instinctively listen this could have been the same person that broke your heart and stole okay um, or made you where you couldn't get money, okay? Um, this is in progression, too, 13 and 14. But it could have been the same person. They're a whole new different person now, okay? And somebody's envious about it. Somebody's having anxiety over it. Over this, over your connection with this person. This man holding the heart and the coin. Okay? Went to the floor. It's coming to your door. You are healed, and you are a healer, okay? You are healed. You're going to be healed um, if you're not completely healed right now, okay? Um, it's really moving fast because um, they did something to you. Um, there's some kind of attachment, um, some kind of change. A strategy needs to be formed. Um, divine's deforming a strategy, okay? Um, the feather's telling me that, and somebody holds the key. Look, there's money here. A compass and a star. Man, this star's all over this damn shit. Look, woman. Oh, I can't make it up. On the bottom of the deck, what you see is the woman holding the coins with adjacent possibilities. She's got other possibilities, but um, she's going to pick this one because this joker is mirroring her, okay? I want you to see a 42 and a 24. Whoever this person is, um, maybe you've gotten confused on who they might be. Whoever it is is mirroring you. They're acting like you. You're acting like them. Okay? I know it sounds crazy, but... Okay, say if they was an asshole, and you're never an asshole, well, you could be awesome. But anyway, if they was a total asshole all the time, and you're not, and you're sweet and kind, um, you're kind of being an asshole, and out of nowhere, they're being sweet and kind. Okay? And people are like, what the hell? These people are mirroring each other, okay? Door to spirit. Um, spirit's making you notice it. Okay? Because I could not figure out last night why I was so mean. I was mean to the girl. I didn't cuss her or nothing. I was just woke up out of my slumber. And and I was like, um, as soon as I went back in the house, boy, I, was, I, I got back up. Like, I laid on the bed for two seconds. I got back up. And I said, Damn, where they at? Looking for because I felt bad about it. Okay, there's some kind of storm coming about this. Okay, um, open up your heart because you've been tied up with your heart. Okay, um, thinking, overthinking everything. Okay, um, you got blossoming abundance and happiness coming. Okay, you just have to make a decision. This is also moving in in progression. I'm singing this yesterday too, Tiny Dancer. Celebration, y'all. Um, this community is about to find out who you are and who they are and what y'all were really meant to do. Okay, this community is going to feel like idiots for what they've been doing to you, okay? Because you're royalty, baby. Straighten up that crown, okay? And and, and don't let them get you down. Um, something's going on, y'all. I'm telling you, I feel like somebody has done a fake marriage or something um, along with... Um, <laughs> like I said, there's three groups of people. That's all I can tell you. Get rest. Because something big's about to happen. Action's coming in. Okay? You got decisions to make. And you're going to get balanced out. Okay? Um, something is really, really going on, y'all. Um, 
of this mirroring, okay? You guys are like, it's crazy, okay? Um, now, you haven't been around your counterpart a long time. Like, you were letting that shit go. Like, letting it go. Like, goodbye, okay? And some sh crazy shit's been going on, okay? Um, it's something about you making a wish. What? They're saying something about you making a wish. They said something about you making a wish. Okay, we're in 45 minutes. Okay. Okay, what do y'all want to tell us? They said something about you making a wish. That you wish for this at one point or another. Um, now, also, they say you don't have to take, you don't have to accept. <coughs> you don't have to accept what um, when this um, counterpart comes in. Um, you can just tell them you to think about it or what have you, okay? You don't have to just accept them blindly what they're saying, okay? Let me see what we got. We got your past supports your future, okay? Somebody in the past is coming forward um, to support you in the, in the future. The edge of evolution feels messy. I told y'all, y'all, it's like the storm before the rainbow. Um, all kinds of crazy shit. Your emotions are going up and down. People are coming at you in different kinds of ways. People are coming at you to show you some type of respect for what you do. Um, whereas before they were making fun of you and laughing at you. Um, they're coming forward and saying, nope, you're, you're the truth. You are the truth, okay? People are coming to you and telling you this, okay? We got 11 and a 40. Um, some kind of stability. It says, find your sacred flow. Okay, 11 and a 12. This is moving in progression. Find your sacred flow in the maze. Okay, um, sacred geometry. That's a nine. Um, it's in all of um, you, all of life. The nine is. Okay, all right. What else? What else we need to know? It says integrate your knowing unstick the stuck because you've done got your mind stuck in something bravely market your magic because you are magic okay um you're not you don't you're not a witch if i have to say that one more freaking time you're not a witch okay your magic comes naturally from god god gave you gifts when you were born because of your soul contract, okay? You had to go through tests in order to figure out these gifts and what they were used for. You thought they were curses for a long time, but now that you're you're more in tune with everything, you understand that these are gifts, okay? You're not a witch. If you resonate like that, I don't know what to tell you. I'm not a witch. I don't mess with witchcraft. I don't mess with... with um, uh, asking demons anything or nothing like that. I, none of it. Okay. I, I trust wholly in the highest power. In God, the, the Holy Spirit, and, and Jesus Christ. Um, my ancestors and my um, uh, the archangels are energy. Um, they're always, always, always flowing through time with me. Okay. You are your ancestors. Um, you bring that energy with you when you come to this 3D world. Okay. Um, it's all the same. Time is fluid. You following me? Um, it, it, time was created by man. Okay, um, God. God's timing is a whole nother story. Okay, um, what could be a, a split second for him, the blink of an eye, is a thousand years. You understand? It says internal validation. Know in your heart. Integrate your knowing within that that you're do you're you're moving the right rise. I can't make it up, y'all. They want you to rise up. You're a shamanic healer. It says your soul shines. What's it end with? A freaking star. I can't make it up. I can't make it up. If any of this resonates with y'all, y'all hit that like button. Hit the um, hit the bell notification so you can get the new videos. If you want to donate to the channel, hit the um, it's Cash App Dollar Sign Angel Moon Six Two Three Seven. If you want to uh, contact me, it's angelmoon62370 at gmail.com. Okay, it says, mix things up, make one significant alteration to your daily routine.
okay? And ditch your phone and get around just using a map and a compass. They want you to look, they want you to go within um, and find your inner compass, okay? They want you to find your inner, um, inner, inner compass. Okay, where's him? Okay, we're gonna get some of these. All right. Give us an everyday peace card, mindful meditation. Why do y'all give me two? That's that's four. You know that, right? They want you to get grounded. Okay. Get grounded. It says you are safe now. You are safe now. A mindful breakfast. Okay. The back says look deeply into your perceptions be a happy formation okay I'm gonna read these and then I'm gonna go okay because um, this is getting really really long oh it's, it's all right until 55 okay it says um you're safe now all kinds of desires are continuations of our original desire to be safe the little child in us continues to worry and be fearful in the present moment there's no problem no threat if we don't have a problem in the present moment, it means we don't have a problem. Why continue to worry and be fearful? We have to transmit, we have to transmit that wisdom into, into the inner child. We need to let the child within us know that he or she is no longer has to be afraid. Okay? You don't have to be afraid no more, little Jeannie Beanie. Okay. <laughs> it says, look deeply into your perceptions. Our perceptions are often inaccurate and cause us to suffer. For example, we may think that if someone is intention to cause us harm, when in truth they are acting from their own suffering and not thinking of us at all. If we look deeply, we can see the true nature of everything. Go beyond our inaccurate perceptions. Look deeply means observing something in someone with so much concentration that the distinction between observer and observed disappears, and we see that all things are um, interrelated. Okay, everything's interrelated. It's all about your perception, y'all. Um, you are safe, okay? A mindful breakfast. Even a daily habit like eating breakfast when done a, as a practice can be powerful. It generates the energy of mindfulness and concentrates, um, concentration that makes life authentic. When we prepare for breakfast, breakfast making uh, can also be a practice. We can really, we can, sorry y'all. We can be really alive, fully present, and very happy during breakfast making. We can see making breakfast as mundane work or as a privilege. It just depends on our way of looking. The cold water is available, the hot water is available, the soap is available, the kettle is available, the fire is available, the food is available. Everything is there to make our happiness a possibility. So everything's available that you need, you just gotta see it, it's your perception. Be a happy formation. This I, the I, is made up of the body and mind. Okay, it's um, Namra Rapa in Sanskrit. The physical form of, is body and all the other elements is San, scan, Scandinous or mind. Okay, um, when we look deeply into the five elements, we do not see any absolute permanent identity. They are impermanent. Um, if you practice in such a way that harmony is established in the realm of the five elements, then joy, peace, and happiness will all be possible. Through breathing, through bringing your mind back to your body, through the method of deep looking, you will reestablish harmony, peace, um, in the realm of the five elements. You, you will become a happy formation, pleasing to encounter, and you will be able to bring happiness to the living beings around you. Okay? Um, so you need to contemplate. Look, um... The I is made up of the body and mind, okay? Um, the physical form of the body and all other element, elements, okay, um, are the mind, okay? You have the physical form of the body, and then you have all the other elements of the, of the mind. You are safe. Be happy. Eat right. And look, look from a different per perception, okay? Because um, somehow you've, like, blinded yourself of uh, looking looking 
you're seeing things in a negative way because of all the shit that's happened to you, okay? Um, but don't, okay? Um, things are being thrown here and there. But you do need to find out, um, I need to find out how you find out about a marriage if you're married and you don't know it. Have you ever stolen anything? Yeah, I have. You know, I'm a sinner. Um, but I ask for forgiveness, so, um, you know, I don't do it all the time, but I have stuff. I don't know anybody who hasn't. <laughs> okay. Um, anyway, I don't do it now. I don't, I don't care about stealing. I don't need to. Like, before I thought I needed it. Okay. Um. Alright, we're going to crush the goals, and then we're going to go. Because this is getting long, and I'm going to forget everything that I done showed y'all. But this, look, your past supports your future. The edge of evolution feels messy. Find your sacred flow. Integrate your knowing. Unstick the stuck. And bravely market your ma your magic. Internal validation rise, and your soul shines, baby. Stay afraid, but do it anyway. I have failed many times in my life, but more importantly, I've learned from every setback. Proudly own up to my mistakes. Grown from disappointments, and now I'm a glamazon bitch ready for the runway. Okay, you're ready. You're ready. You ain't got nothing to fear. It says you are enough just as you are. Okay? If it resonates, y'all hit the button. Uh, I'm going to read out of this book because, yeah, we got about four minutes to make it an hour or so. It says, wade up. Y'all, I've read this part page before. Apparently, they want me to read it again. Something was weighed up in 2009, okay, on April 12th, okay. It says something about some photos, okay. It says, I managed to sort out mom's photo archive. It was a stroke of luck, but that does that's done too. Now we can really sell that house. Somebody's wanting to sell a house. It was a lot harder for me to take care of mom's things than dad's. For several reasons, and truth be told, I didn't take care of it all. Um, those thousands of thousands of photos, so beautiful, really embarrassed me and sometimes hurt me. Looking at those portraits of art, architects and artists Mom collaborated with, I couldn't help but wonder which one of them had been her lover. And anyway, my heart ached to see all those people, all that talent, that whole world around her, where there was never any room for Dad, not even the tiniest corner. It's true that Dad's world was with his sci-fi novels and his scale models cut Mom out too, but there was no one else there. It was a solitary. Okay, um, so, yeah. Um, he's noticing how his parents don't communicate, okay? All right, well, um, I'm going to go ahead and go now um, before this gets too long and cuts off by itself, <laughs> which it could. Um, and... Um, I hope you, I hope this resonates. God dang, y'all keep me doing shit. Look, if I could, y'all, I'd use every single deck of cards that I got. Uh, and every reading. Because <laughs> I love them all. They all have their own little personality and they talk to me differently, okay? So, I, I want to keep using them. And now that I got these new cards, I want to use them and the old ones. But I want to do them all and I can't do it. There's not enough time. It says, choose an Arnold Schwarzenegger character. I don't know. I don't know who I would choose. I'm not. You know. Probably kindergarten cop. It says, can someone can can summon anything from martial arts catalog? Leading an army of gremlins, Maverick pre Goose dying, Dirk the the daring. That's a that's a play on um on uh, Darth Vader. No, it ain't. That's a, a Viking. Beetlejuice. Someone's coming here. Someone may be coming in to help you, and someone else may be coming in to say that they're helping you, but they're, they have some other agenda. It says, armed with Rubik's Cube grenades that um, explode if they aren't solved. So you're going to get this solved, okay? Because you're not going to have no Rubik's Cube explode in your freaking hand. That's all I'm saying, okay? Um, uh, you're, 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 you're not, you're not going to do it, okay? Okay. All right, someone's gonna come save you tonight. Y'all hear me? You're an angel. You hear that? 
It says, Prophets and Ancient Seers, Decisions, Predictive Guidance, is Shamic Healer. That's what started the whole reading, okay? You are an angel. I'm going to go ahead and pull some of these since we're doing it. Shit. This is a long video. I don't even know because y'all don't, y'all don't be paying. I don't know. Y'all don't pay attention to them when they get real long. Okay, it says seagulls. So I like to keep them around 30. It says bounce. Um, you're just mind your own business and people come at you. Um, it says hate. Okay, you're going to have to release hate because they hate you. Chained. You're chained to something. But be secure and confident. These lies. There's some kind of lies going on around you. Okay, that's got you ready to bounce. So someone's being charming. Could be you, could be them. But like I said, charm. Y'all, this is the devil. Charm is the devil. Could be a Capricorn. It says kindness. Somebody was being charming, but these says C goals with an S. Okay, so there's two of them. Um, kind of like the sparrow in the hurricane. Um, but somebody's been lying and they're chained to you, and they won't tell you how they feel, okay? Um, it's like a love-hate thing. Um, they're, they're hating that they love you or something. I don't know, um, but they're coming to to, to their self about it, okay? Um, they're figuring it out, okay? All right, well, I keep feeling like there's one more thing to do. One more, one more thing. I don't know what that is, okay? I don't know what the one more thing is. Rise up, okay? All right, your soul shines. You're a star. Create fire. It's, t it's saying create this spark. Okay, that's what I'm getting from that. It's telling you to create this spark. Okay. I'm going to do these because these are so beautiful. And then I'm going to go. I keep saying that, but I am. Okay, I have to after this. Oh, that's the ones I was going to look at. I'll do a reading. I'll do another reading later. Okay. What do we need to know? Work. What is mine for the doing? So, do work um, and, and, and try to do something nice for somebody. I feel bad about that girl last night, but I think she made it home. But still, it says, where is my strength? Okay. Um. It's telling you to work and, and, and find your inner strength, okay? It says, B, how can I know myself is absolute? Bison. There's hearts on that. Love yourself, okay? Swim. Am I flowing through the metamorphosis? All right, like loving. See you on the flip side. <laughs>